national security is no longer an abstract thing. The United States has had the single best defense of any country in the history of all countries with two large oceans. Um, and then the North and South geography that has uh, give, been given us a very unique opportunity privilege uh, as a country to grow the way we have. Um, and cybersecurity and the internet uh, has changed that. And what we have now is you can have somebody with malicious intent and capability wake up in Beijing or Moscow and decide to do something. And what's so big about that, and I'm really glad that the US government changed its position about 2015, is turns out in the number one economy that rests on digital data, data care, that software is just as much of a national security component as anything else. And that's why we see the attacks on businesses. That's why we see the rise of ransomware that Chris Krebs and I announced back in 2020 at RSA becoming the scourge of national security that it is. And what all of you see is that you are now on the front lines of your private industry being in that arena. And even worse than that, these folks don't discriminate. They go after our water utilities. They go after our schools. They go after our municipal governments. The basic building blocks of how we live our lives is under attack every single day. And so cybersecurity, not to get too carried away with it, is absolutely a national security thing, whether you have anything to do with any government at all or just private industry.